Hello everyone, my name is Francesco Cipollone. I'm the CEO and founder of Phoenix Security. As part of the Cyber Awareness Month for October, we wanted to focus more on the visualization and the data that sits behind a lot of the vulnerability and a lot of the buzzword that we hear across the board. We heard OWASP, we heard application security, we heard uh, exploitability, we heard spam, we heard a lot of those buzzwords and sometimes we use it without even understanding what sits behind. So we wanted to demystify a lot of this noise and buzzword and really give to you the data that sits behind those vulnerability at scale um, to basically dig a little bit behind it. So as part of that effort, we actually publish a series of data visualization board. We're going to start on OWASP and OWASP top 10. Uh, and the most vulnerability uh, exploited at scale. Uh, you can see here we publish under Phoenix security slash what is OWASP main um, is the main visualization where we're going to focus on the data that sits behind CWE and the top vulnerability exploited in application security. And as part of the flagship of OWASP, the OWASP top 10 checkbox, what sits behind OWASP top 10s and how has it changed over the years. Now, if we dig in, in the first uh, sections uh, on OWASP top 10 and the vulnerability around data, we can see fundamentally which are the CWE, that are fundamentally the methodology of attacks that describe a specific vulnerability and which vulnerability is actually more pre prevalent across data set, um, which type of CWE and OWASP top 10 uh, uh, map back, we're going to uh, we're gonna talk around the OWASP top 10 mapping in a second, towards uh, EPSS or which uh, CWE is more present in, uh, for example, CISA-CAV and the uh, known exploited vulnerability, which one is the methodology of attack that is more consistent across the board or over the years, which one is the vulnerability that is more exploited and how does it map to OWASP top 10 over the years? Now we took as a reference the 2021 mapping of OWASP top 10. Uh, we're gonna see below that uh, fundamentally there are different version of OWASP top 10. Um, in here you can see as well uh, the type of vulnerability map across the years and the top 50. So the, the most exploited vulnerability uh, from a CWE perspective and um, OWASP top 10 remapping. As you can see, the top 10 is actually a, a reflection on a lot of these uh, top vulnerability exploited at scale. Now, if you want to see as well how OWASP has evolved over the years, we map basically vulnerability from OWASP top 10 across every year and how certain type of vulnerability uh, like um, security misconfiguration or injection have changed over the years or how certain one uh, has basically stopped existing or renamed or being reshaped in different uh, kind of vulnerability or in different uh, remark and typology. Now, there is a link between CWE and um, OWASP uh, over the years. And you can see here how uh, the CWE top 10 have changed over the years and the OWASP top 10 have changed over the years, which are the uh, CWE that have been more prevalent mapped back uh, to the various OWASP top 10 over the year. And uh, to dive a little bit deeper, we wanted to reanalyze the OWASP top 10 uh, over the 21 version of the OWASP top 10 and which CWE they map back and which one of the CWE that is more prevalent in terms of presence of vulnerability exploitation uh, across the board. Uh, so I hope you enjoy this um, overview of application security data visualization in OWASP top 10 over the year. My name is Francesco Cipollone. We're going to do a number of this iteration and this visualization over October 2023, Cyber Awareness Month. Don't trust anyone, trust only the data that sits behind your vulnerability. This is Francesco Cipollone. Stay safe out there. Goodbye.